Now tonight at 6, while many Ole Miss players were outspoken against the move to remove head football coach Matt Luke, what do fans think? 12 News, Kate Cornell took the pulse of Rebels fans and she joins us now in the studio. Kate? Melanie and Jade, the much discussed Egg Bowl ending may have been the final straw, and the Ole Miss Rebels are going to shake things up for the 2020 season. Winning just four out of 12 games this year will not suffice for Ole Miss's athletics department. The school fired its head coach, Matt Luke. Losses are tough. Even though the Egg Bowl turned on a personal conduct penalty. I was the classiest move. Definitely not the classiest moment. Matt Luke may be a Mississippi native and an Ole Miss alum. But some fans I spoke with say it's time for a change. Just had to see him go, but yeah, we definitely need to move on. Ole Miss players have been asked not to comment publicly on the matter. But fans around the Metro are not silent, reacting on social media and in person. Justin Collier has been an Ole Miss fan his whole life. He says he wishes it didn't have to come to this, but that he is looking forward to the future. I think it's a pretty good thing because now we get to bring somebody else new in. And now we can really see what the football team is about. Brandon Hayes, another rebel diehard, agrees with Collier. I thought he was a great interim coach. The record speaks for itself, though. I mean, he wasn't winning, and you got to have a you gotta have somebody there that can get the job done. William Eaton went to Ole Miss. He thinks coaches need more time to prove themselves before a decision like this is made. The reality of college football is it takes about four years to build a team, and you can see that in any number of programs. And to expect some sort of miracle to happen in a year, year and a half, you're back to square one. Now you have to start the process over again. I asked Eaton if there's anyone who could pull off an overnight miracle in the SEC. She hired Saban. <laughs> Eaton, of course, was referring to Alabama coach Nick Saban. Ole Miss Athletics has not yet announced who will be Luke's successor. Melanie and Jade. Thank you, Kate. Luke was in his third season as head coach at Ole Miss. The firing came right after Ole Miss lost in the Egg Bowl in an unsportsmanlike call that pushed back a potentially game-tying extra point. We'll have more on the coaching shakeup at Ole Miss later in sports.